the fight between good and evil, God has the last laugh with the unexpected. Who would have ever expected a dead man to rise from the dead? Early theologians such as Augustine and John Chrysostom suggested that this was the greatest prank ever played. God played a practical joke on the devil by defeating death and rising from the dead. Theologians call this the Rissus Pascalis, meaning the Easter laugh. Jesus came back to life and laughed at death. Holy Hilarity Day was practiced as early as the 13th century to reward churchgoers for a solemn Lenten season. It was especially popular between the 14th and 15th centuries, although the Reformation of the 17th and 18th centuries suppressed it. In eight, I'm sorry, 1988, Cal Samara founded the Fellowship of Merry Christians in the U.S. and has brought back this medieval tradition. So I thank you today for letting me introduce it to Denville Community Church. Today is a day to relax and enjoy with joy and laughter Easter. So let me begin with a joke. Do you know who the greatest comedian in the Bible was? Samson. He brought down the house. <laughs> Excellent. We're off to a good start. George Burns, who is an American comedian, was an American comedian, once said that the secret to a good sermon is to have a good beginning and a good end and to have the two as close together as possible. So I hope that this is one of the better, hopefully the best sermons you've ever heard. Will you please pray with me? Holy God, thank you for this wonderful morning to worship you and celebrate baptisms. Lord God, will you please bless the words that I speak and the words that are heard so that we may truly understand how to follow you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. This morning's sermon is entitled, Sin, Don't Do It. Sin, don't do it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> the real sermon is sin, don't do it. YK is going to play for a time of reflection. <laughs> <laughs> 